Hello and welcome back. My name is Daily Fix, and we continue with our Stellaris guide. We're playing as the Commonwealth of Men, and it's starting to feel much more as a playthrough where I am just making decisions and just focusing on taking out this hive mind, our very first enemy, that also made it so that we could actually be somewhat more in the range of our hostile neighbors. We also started to make claims on our enemy because, well, these guys will back us up. If they declare war on us, they will back us up. If they declare war on us, these guys will back us up. Do we want these guys to get a foothold in here? Do, they, do we want that? No, we, we actually, we don't. We want to keep them as far away from us as possible. Possible. Uh, these guys should be following you. We don't necessarily need a new leader, but we do want to upgrade all of our ships again because we'll have better armor. And we'll have to do that right here, so we're on the right station right now. We got three destroyers. It's not too much, but it will definitely help. Uh, research agreement between two nations that is not us. Also, we want to be getting more alloys. As you can see, we're starting to take a bit of a penalty. Construction complete. Okay, construction is complete over there. Which is okay. Eventually, all of these stations will probably disappear. Uh, because there is no new. There you go. Closed borders. They can now no longer resupply. And by the looks of it, most of their armies, most of their fleets are gone they're not nearby oh that is brilliant that is absolutely fantastic so it gives us an opportunity it it does because if we would declare war right now we could probably take one or two systems before having to deal with these guys how strong is the station 1.9k it doesn't matter anymore it doesn't because we have more than enough to deal with that so let's make sure that we start focusing a bit more on this station over here. And I'm actually considering flipping it over to maybe missiles because they're not using point defense. And missiles do pack a bit of a punch. This, this ship is just not doing anything anymore. Um, we don't need a bastion in this one. Let's see... You have stuff that we could sell. Construction complete. Construction complete. The science ship. What are you doing? Nothing. Is there anything else that just changed? Where is this? There is something. So we got a new archaeological site over there. Yeah, I'm aware that I'm not doing too much with it. And uh, maybe you guys want to see, but. It's just, we, we didn't get anything good out of it. At least I don't think so. We didn't get any relics. And uh, we could still sell private stuff. And, and yeah, It's not too interesting at the moment. If we get a relic, sure. Why not? Yeah, these guys are going back now. Mm, it means the war could be over quite soon. These guys are definitely not doing too well. It won't be long until this, uh, this hive is superior. There is definitely something over there. Again? Upgrade then. Just do it. You can do this. Maybe if you're not past. Construction complete. I kind of want to start moving you over here. And I want to take out this fleet. First. So let's start moving them over there. 4.8k. If we go station for station, we can heal up. I kind of would really like not to you lose this station. So, let's see if we can upgrade that station. Inbound message traffic. Yeah. Wonder where that's going to be. A research deal. With you again? Edicts on the farming subsidies have been... Gone. Uh, hopefully we'll keep in the positive. I 
Train of one, two. Let's see. How much are we lacking? 55. Inbound message traffic. Migration treaty. Let's um, accept that for now. You are lacking amenities. We do want to make that change. In terms of food, yeah, it will be fine. It's just a negative two. Who cares about a negative two anyways? I don't. Let's not increase that. Because we are going to build up our very first star hold. We need to make sure that it is uh, finished before entering this war. Um, otherwise, this is going to be nasty. Very, very nasty. Uh, I want to make a good selection. Look, it, you can see here. Ship hull points plus 10%. Armor hull points plus 10%. And this is what it also it, it does. Trade protection plus 5. Alien scum. More ideological things have been discovered apparently. Science division report success. Energy from technicians, which is really good. There you go. This is what we want. We need to get the mole, uh, the the moat harvesting traps in order for us to get like the um, the upgraded version of our alloy production. Our fleet is over there. We need to hold for a second longer. Let's get a missile and other thing. We will go over our naval cap just a tiny bit. Uh, okay, well met, I guess. It's unfortunate. Still nothing too interesting. So our armies are there. Let's take a quick look at their planets. If yeah, we we should be able to do to our listening post. Armies, two armies. We out damage them, which is great. So I'm hoping they will just destroy their fleets in here somewhere. But that won't be too long. That's why we need the station to be finished. With the additional upgrading. With, let's see. Hmm. Shield hit points negative 20. That is kind of nice. Ship weapon range plus 50 is also very nice. So we want to get both of these. Consumer goods is down as well. Uh, we'll, we'll get there. We'll, 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 we'll offset that. With some more uh, buildings. Once we gain more energy. We're going into. Um, our policies. And we are probably going to change the wealth creation. Into this. So we'll gain more consumer goods from it. But we'll lose some energy. But I don't want to do that right now. Oh, these guys are going back. Mm. That could be annoying. They might be um, figuring out what we're up to. And they just don't like the fact that we are just building up our fleet. How tough is this station? Not tough enough. And I kind of don't feel that I want to fight on two fronts. So taking this out as soon as possible is actually the best thing you could do. Uh, the reason for it is they cannot resupply. I feel this station will fall. But this is now 668 and it will change quite soon. Maybe some defensive stations. But remember defensive stations can be destroyed. Let's do more alloys. So disruption field. There you go 1.2k. I want to get the targeting computer in there. I want to get missile and gun battery. Once this is done, 
it's probably as good as time as any to uh, deal with this. Because they're starting to build up. Look, they are taking losses. They are no longer at war. That is what's going on. Are you not at war with anyone? No. That's a problem. That definitely is a problem. Uh, rivalry has ended, so these guys are going to be best buddies. Unfortunately, that will not change their faith. Eventually, we will have to deal with them. As well as we need to deal with this. So 1.9. This is going to be a, a heavy station. I can promise you that. Probably 3 or 4k. Stations are definitely, definitely, well, worrying to, uh, to deal with. Oh, there's actually, this one is not connected. Let's uh, make that so. This one, connect there, please. Thank you. That should generate a tiny bit more energy for us. How much do we get from trade? Like 64 from trade. So if we were to change that, then it will go to 30 and it would drown us. It will increase our consumer goods, yes, but it would drown us and we don't, don't want that. Yeah, there's no need to do this. Now, we're not at war yet, so we might as well just continue the upgradation of our fleet. The more we have, the better. Because we are just going to have our fleets take these out as soon as possible. And then head over here. And hopefully, this station is still available for us. And we can defend while our armies just take down their planets. And we'll deal about the open areas sooner so ship firing rate ship upkeep or naval capacity hmm i'll go for the ship firing rate so we're 4.8 that should change us there you go to five naval cap we're over but it will be fine it will be fine there you go all of these have been done the field disruptor is going to be built how strong is the station 2.4 k Oh, no, 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 I will not go into a federation. I like you, but we are not going to go there. Eventually, I need to kill you. Population growth speed plus 10%. Hmm. I think we might as well just go for the psionics. Right now. Although naval cap plus 30 will get me out of the red number. So let's do it. Uh, being insulted by the hive. That is never a good sign. Well, not for them. Um, by the looks of it. We should be able to, f to deal with that soon enough. This is going to be such an important system. Uh, if we lose that, then... Ugh. Let's flip you into anchoring. Negative 7, wow. Let's take a quick look. Let's do a build-up over there. And give me a second, because the dogs are barking, so someone, someone is downstairs. Let's, um, not do anything at the moment. Give me a second. Okay. Apparently, my headphone. Ah, there you go. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, my father, uh, my father-in-law... Was uh, struggling around the uh, building. Let's see. We weren't going to do anything about that. I'm thinking about changing that decision. We are already building up food over there. So that's going to be 12. That should be enough. But um, I kind of kind of feel the need. But uh, we might do that later. To get another alloy building 
around here. Uh, just so we'll have a bit more. Uh, just a tiny, tiny bit more. Let's just continue. So the station, once this is done, it's going to be it. It is going to be time to fight. And uh, we will. Uh, you probe the crystal. So we will probably gain like 800 energy from that. That's why I'm saying it. It's I don't want to waste too much time on, on that. And this will offset that a tiny, tiny bit. Eventually this station will disappear. So what I'm seeing in the future is um, this station will be a keeper. This is a keeper. Um, this is going to be a keeper. There are going to be a station over here. Here, there. We'll, we'll, we'll place multiple stations uh, around positions that could be crucial for us to, um, to hold on to. So the construction has been complete. That does change our naval cap a tiny, tiny bit. So our fleets are now coming in from this angle. Meaning this, this, this is a good shipyard for this area. But we will need a shipyard in here somewhere. You eventually want to have multiple shipyards. So the closest one is going to be making sure that you are able to resupply your fleet as soon as possible do i want to get this fleet capped out 91 this this takes a long time traveling i'd say let's save up let's save up for now and soon we uh, will definitely have a war on our hands i wonder what they will do 2000 3,000. Let's take a quick look at designs before we get in there. Heavy on shields. And now starting to use missiles. You bloody bastards. Hmm. Oh, there you go. We don't have to worry about this. Will these guys... Yes, they are. Look at that. They, they turn blue. That is, they are going to be... Uh, well, we don't have to set a wall all their hives. We don't care about them. Uh, they turn blue. So they are going to send in fleets to help us. Um, we don't want to close borders. This is great. This is great. Next episode, these hives are no more. Well, probably not that no more. But we will definitely deal with them. Um... We don't have to resupply anymore. We're going to be in here because there's a fleet. Then go there. And just wiping out these stations. Like I said, we're wiping out the stations. Then beelining over here. And just holding this position. It's almost completely filled. And it's going to be strong. It's going to be very powerful. Um, the missiles... They're going to be annoying. They truly are. That's why I'm probably just going to dial you down. And adding the destroyer picket class. Up to 10. So we have 10 on 10. That's why I was debating earlier on. If we should add the picket destroyer. I kind of wish that I did now. That would have saved us a bit of hassle. We do want to get a construction ship and I'm saying that I'm probably certain there is going to be one in here but that's uh, that's it for now um, next time we'll have an ally on our side it doesn't look good for them I can promise you their fleets they have by the looks of it two fleets of 3k so that's already 6k we're very close of being as strong as our neighbor and I'd say we probably would be able to deal with them. They got auto cannons. They got that, that. That's quite strong. I do like auto cannons. And they have point defense, so they would definitely be well more suited to fight the hive. But I'm thinking it's going to be um, as good as time as any just to kill these guys off. I want to get this out of the way before they arrive. I don't need. Our neighbor occupying territory over here. I kind of would like to have this area here as well. So we could go to war with uh, the Minovia. Yeah, 
fun times are approaching yet again. Thank you all for watching, hope you are enjoying yourself, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.